It's the stuff that keeps you on the edge of your seat. TV shows like Numbers show the FBI at work in search of terrorists and murderers. And now the real life FBI is in search of several thousand new employees. We are special agents. We are intelligence analysts. It's the biggest hiring blitz in the Bureau's 100 year history, partly because of natural turnover and partly because it's been hard to compete for employees with the high paying private sector. Until now, the economic bust is proving a boon to the Bureau. Within 24 hours of putting out the call, the FBI's website got 600,000 hits, and the FBI Human Resources Division got inundated. And approximately 20,000 applications have been submitted. 20,000 applications? Yes. The Bureau is looking for 850 special agents and 2,100 support staffers. So this isn't just about learning how to shoot a gun and hunt people down. No. You are looking for everything. Exactly. We are looking for analytical professionals, scientific professionals, computer IT professionals, auto mechanic, uh, general clerical and administrative professionals. Uh, there's even a position out there for a woodcrafter. So... A woodcrafter <laughs> at the FBI. Absolutely. Case in point, but Did you know the FBI has a historian? You can't have a better job. I mean, really, you're being asked to do some of the most important stuff that our nation does. In recent years, the Bureau has had trouble finding employees who measure up. That's why there are 500 spots left over from last year. Where do people usually fall down? Uh, we lose approximately 30% on the polygraph. If you're interested, to be a special agent, you have to be between 23 and 36, have a college degree, a skill like a foreign language, and pass a physical fitness test. For any of the jobs, you have to be a U.S. citizen. You've got to ace that polygraph, and you have to act quickly. The deadline to apply is next week. Kimberly Dozier, CBS News, Washington.